I would hope that people could understand why I'm doing this. Fuck you bitches. Because you have chose the way of the oppressor. You have dressed it up. You have made it comfortable for yourself because you, you are sleeping one way or another with that beast. He's signing your check. Huh? He, you know, he, he's doing these marvelous things for you, nigga. You got your 401k. Bitch, you got your retirement fund, bitch. And so, Seti is out of line. Because that cracker got something he's giving you. And you are in allegiance with that beast. Too bad. The babies, they want freedom. The babies, they want liberation. The young black generation that comes up, they deserve a nation today, not tomorrow. Today, not tomorrow. Right motherfucking not. These are kings and queens, and it should not be in theory. It should not be in I just going back and forth on God, king, queen. Bitch, ain't no king without a motherfucking throne. And the throne represents land. And you do not ask no motherfucker for your shit. You take it. Too raw for you. Too raw for you. I know. I know. Coming at y'all ass today with the intentions to shake this shit up. The summer of Africa 2010, motherfuckers out there need to start gathering uh, workshops, uh, all type of activities on the uh, traditional African culture. No Christianity, no Islam, no motherfucker. Even they are invited, but they can lead that shit right where they got it. We were traditional, and that's and we got to come to understand what is traditional. All of these things that are plaguing the community. Well, we 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 allow anybody to say this is African. This is African. There must be a a loud voice of our people that say this is what it is, and get them, And once we bang this this these philosophies out, once we bang our culture out. Get the dents out of the motherfucking, you know, out of our culture. Polish it up. You got to polish it up. Let it shine. Show the, the youth. This is Africa. This is something to be proud of. Get these weak ass niggas off our fucking bandwagon and, and get, be a man, be a woman. Look these bitches in their face and say, we through it, y'all. We had, we, we had our dealings with you. We did not prosper at all. 2010, we must have a consensus on what, where this race is going. Nobody know where the fuck they're going. That should be the main objective of 2010. Where the fuck are we going? Nobody knows. And that's why motherfucker over here, motherfucker over here, motherfucker over here, motherfucker over here. And you mad, bitch, wake up. Wake up. A lot of motherfuckers think that I'm mad at a lot of groups. Motherfuckers think I'm beefing with the nation of God. I'm not beefing with them. Them is my motherfucking peoples. But we done. Not only the, the Mars, the motherfucking Christian, the Muslim bitch, all you niggas, including myself, we have to wake the fuck up. That shit is gone. It is not working. God damn it, it is not working. It is not working. No matter what you say. No matter what you say. We have to come together. We have to create a new philosophy that can get our people to true liberation and true motherfucking freedom. So this is your brother, Sarah Sue and Sadi. Woo! Y'all motherfuckers got me sweating trying to rip it. I come hard every time because I want to drop this shit so it's reverberating through the motherfucking universe. Wake up. Make your plans. Get your festival together for your particular city. I'm going to try to run through your town. I'm going to try to burn the motherfucker down. Just get at me. I'm not going to be able to come everywhere. 
but we're going to get it together. And I'm going to pull up in some cities, and I'm going to drop it, and I'm going to wake the motherfuckers up. It'll never be the same. This is the spirit we're dying in these cities, family. We have to make the decision that we must do it this year. You must try to do it right now, today. Don't wait till the summer. We want to go in the summer already banging. We got to start right now. What are we going to have for the babies? The workshop. You got some old shit? Yeah, that's old. We want some new invigorating workshops. It must include hip-hop. It must include hip-hop in its rawest form. Not no motherfucking skinny dreads and skinny jeans. That's not hip-hop. Uh, when I say hip-hop, I'm talking about street, raw. I'm not talking about no bougie niggas trying to think they hip-hop because they dressing and, and, and yo, yo, yo. Fuck that, nigga. This is hip-hop, nigga, in its purest form, nigga. Raw with no motherfucking cut on it. So we must include the hip-hop cats, the thug cats, these gorillas, these G's, we must make a place for these streets. I begin that, y'all, on the regular, giving you the momentum. We'll be, we'll be uh, pulling out some workshops that we think that motherfuckers can uh, really have an uh, impact with. You should start talking amongst one another. Get your festival together. It could be already an existing festival where you get your place in it and you have your workshops within the festival, enhance the festival, or you can get your own. It could be in your hood. It could be on the corners where you take four, five corners, block them off, and do your thing. You know how we do. When y'all motherfuckers on the silk and smoke, you, you can do it. You can get it together. But when we talk about the summer of Africa, oh, we can't get no permit. If you, got, if you need a permit, to always do something, bitch, you ain't gonna never have nothing because the peck of wood gonna block you, the city gonna block you. You got to come up with some new ideas and some new ways to do things. This is your brother, Saw Ra Sutton said he said, hey, arm yourself with knowledge. Bang on that wicked ass beast daily. Liberation through confrontation. Be getting at y'all real motherfucking soon. Leave that shit alone. That cussing shit, leave that shit to a pro.